Before the end of 2010, Utahsat will launch KASAT, the first in Europe of a new generation of high-throughput satellites to support the continuing expansion of digital services, both for professional and consumer markets. Fully operating in K-band frequencies, this new satellite will be located at 9 degrees east. KASAT will be ideally positioned to provide additional resources to telecom operators, broadcasters and ISPs for data and video services over Europe and the Mediterranean Basin. KASAT will also supply Utahsat with a substantial platform for expansion of its two-way broadband service, launched in 2007 via KA Bank Capacity, already available on its Hobart 6 satellite. KASAT's design is spearheading new developments in satellite technology. The satellite will be equipped with more than 80 spot beams, each covering a region of a few hundred kilometers. This multi-spot architecture allows extensive frequency reuse by groups of beams covering distinct regions that results in exceptionally high levels of operational efficiency and takes KASAT's overall capacity to record levels. With resources of more than 70 gigabits per second, it will be possible for a single satellite to connect over 1 million households to broadband. 900 megabits per second of capacity shared on the forward and return paths are provided for each spot beam. This exceptionally high throughput satellite, in addition to being ideal for internet and point-to-point -point bidirectional applications in general, is also perfectly suited for local and regional television channels, which are targeting audiences concentrated in a small area. It also enables the management of video and data applications, requiring very high bit rates, particularly distribution of HD and 3D digital cinema in push or on demand. The KSAT satellite will form the cornerstone of a major new infrastructure deployed in Europe and the Mediterranean Basin. The infrastructure will also comprise a network of gateways, interconnected by fibre and connected to the internet backbone. Each gateway will manage broadband connections between the internet and users via a group of spot beams on the satellite. The complete network will be managed by Utasat Skylogic subsidiary from its Turin teleport in Italy. KSAT's arrival will open an incredible new era for broadband access for consumers and businesses located in areas underserved by terrestrial networks. The new two-way compact consumer equipment will include a satellite dish linked to a modem that will interface with the user's PC. Communications from the user will be sent by the dish to the satellite. The satellite will forward them to a gateway which will transfer them to the internet. Communications to the user will take the same path in the opposite direction. Through a single dual-feed KU and KA band antenna, connected both to a TV set and PC, two-way customers will have the opportunity to enhance their television experience by receiving programs from additional orbital locations, in particular the 1100 channel offer broadcast via Utahsat's hotbed satellites at 13 degrees east. Utahsat is cooperating with Viasat in order to use its advanced Surfbeam 2 technology for the gateways and user terminals. Viasat's technology is already providing broadband connectivity for over 500,000 subscribers in North America. On the back of this strong consumer demand, Viasat will launch its Viasat 1 KE band multi-spot satellite for the North American market in 2011. With the deployment of common technology, the KSAT and Viasat 1 satellite broadband programs will enable considerable economies of scale to make satellite internet accessible to a broad number of homes and businesses with speeds and costs comparable to terrestrial networks. With the launch of KSAT, Utahsat is opening an incredible new space to communicate in Europe and the Mediterranean basin. This groundbreaking satellite demonstrates Utahsat's commitment to propel forward the digital revolution and make broadband accessible for everyone.